after you're watching this video, I bet you like building just as I do. The Minecraft bases I build tend to have a lot of rooms, with one of my favorites being a library or a study. This kind of room has such a nice vibe while also being functional. And today guys, I'm going to be showing you three interior ideas that will look lovely in any Minecraft library, including the mystery one from my Instagram, which is at the Aether Gamer, by the way, if you want to check it out. But let's jump into the fireplace. Every cozy library needs a warm fireplace for your Minecraft character to relax next to. Start off with two campfires right next to each other. You can use soul campfires too, depending on your preference, but I am using normal ones today. Place two polished blackstone stairs on each side like so, and then two more upside down polished blackstone stairs on top of those. Then, follow along carefully as I place some polished blackstone slabs. We're going to add some knickknacks to the top of the fireplace to make it feel more homey. You can add whatever you want, but I'm adding an eye of ender, some sea pickles, a creeper head, and a pot with a lily of the valley. These items create a beautiful green theme, which I think is pretty nice. After that, we're going to make a shaggy looking carpet with some fire coral fans. The trick to making sure the coral doesn't die is using waterlogged slabs. Follow along carefully as I waterlog the ground around the campfire. And lastly, we can place our coral fans to complete this snug little interior area. to go. We're now going to move on to this nice and compact little desk. Kick things off by placing an upside down oak stair just like this. Then place two oak fences right on top of it with an oak trapdoor above that as well. Place an oak slab right next to the trapdoor and place another trapdoor right next to the slab in this pattern. Place a lantern on top of this trapdoor for some lighting. After doing this, make sure to put a banner on the trapdoor as well, along with another trapdoor right below it. Place an ender chest and a lectern like I'm doing on screen, and above the ender chest, put an item frame with an enchanted book. We're now going to move on to some finishing touches for the build, mainly using invisible item frames. Right above the lectern, place an invisible item frame with a clock, which gives off a nice effect. You can also add an invisible item frame on the fence here, and on the lectern here, and place two more banners in both of them. That just about concludes our desk. For anyone who came here from Instagram, this is the final mystery idea. A gorgeous enchanting cable bookcase area that's beautiful and functional. Say goodbye to basic enchantment table setups guys, because you can get level 30 enchantments with this design. First of all, we're going to start off by placing down our enchantment table. Pretty simple stuff. Then, follow along as I make these bookshelf walls. we are going to repeat the same pattern on the other three sides as well. You can replace some of the bookshelves with looms to give the impression of empty bookcases. Just keep in mind, you might need to use a debug stick or replace the looms a few times to get it completely right. As you do this, 
Make sure that you keep checking the enchantment table levels. You will need at least 15 bookcases around your table for it to give you level 30 enchantments, so don't put too many looms in. Then, place a 5 block high column of stripped oak logs diagonally from each of the wall corners, just like this. Put oak stairs around the base of these pillars, connecting with the bookcases. Next, we're also going to make our choice to make this look all fancy. Follow along carefully as I make this design. After that, add lanterns in the middle of the archways for some additional lighting and coziness. Oh man! And finally, replace them on the floor with lapis just like this. Of course, this is completely optional, as you might want to put your lapis to other uses in survival mode. And there you have it. A cozy fireplace, a nice and compact desk, and a fully functional enchantment table, which also has nice decoration. If you have any other ideas for videos that I can make, please don't hesitate at all to comment it down below, or to reach out to me on Instagram at the TheAetherGamer once again. I really hope that you guys enjoyed, and I will see you in the next one. Goodbye!